we're going to do something a little bit different. The distributor of this action cam called Ekin just sent me this camera to test. And I've been too much inside my office and inside the shop and I haven't had a time to test it. So what I'm gonna do today is I'm on my skates already. I'm going to jump on the scooter, get into town and try to get a few clips filmed with this thing. And I'll also get some drone shots in the city. Table Mountain which is the highest mountain in Cape Town and I'm just gonna find my drone a little bit so that I can show you a little bit of the Cape Town beauty and then I'm gonna try to skate a little bit around and test some shots with the action camera the only shots that you'll be seeing with the action camera are going to be the fisheye ones and then I'm gonna be using these other camera for other types of shots also the the action camera is the Ekin H8R that says in the in the camera that shoots 4k but I'm not gonna use 4k because when it sh when you film 4k it only films with 15 frames per second and then it creates 15 fake frames so I'm gonna go with a 1080 60 frames per second I feel like using a action camera. I'm like a real action man. Look at this. <laughs> I even got my camera stuck on my shorts. Like a real action man. Told you. People keep asking me, why did you move to Cape Town? Well, main reason, my beautiful wife, of course. Before it wasn't a wife, but that was the main reason. Then, so much to do related to skating and then check this. Geographically, this city is just the best thing ever. The most beautiful city on earth, that's for sure. Hey, this is Cape Town. You just skate the mountain. Now I'm going to the city. It's gonna take me like, I don't know. If I would skate, it would take me like five minutes. But since I need to go back to, to the office, I would say two minutes on the scooter. So 
so ah man let's get those the scooter huh <laughs> Close it. We just we just got to, to Boca, which is like one of the most iconic places from Cape Town with all these colored houses in my back. And I just thought it would be cool to get like a clip or two here. So I'll see what I can do here. I don't know if they're gonna let me skate or not, but I'll see. Oh, check this one. Check this spot. Right behind me. Ha, I think we got the spot right here. See? Rolls? All right, we got this. Not really the best I just got kicked out. Need to leave. At least I got a clip. <laughs> the what? Inline skates, man. Inline. Yeah. Like you call it rollerblades, right? Yes, I know. The proper mean? name, it's inline skates. So where did you purchase this man? I sell them. Easy. Yeah, I have a shop in where? in Parn Island. Oh, Barton Island. Yeah. So there's a skate park called the Shred. Yes. And I I, I have a shop inside. You need to get some. I like it. I got my friends here. What's your name? Ismail. Ismail and Rafik. Wafik. Uh, what? Wafik. I thought it was Rafik. <laughs> <laughs> All the way from Puka. Like Janice would say, mission accomplished. Now, <laughs> there's this drop that I want to do. Just like a little king ledge drop. I've been hiding it for quite a while. It's nothing big, but I think I'm just gonna go there and just do it on my way to the office. And then I think there's another flat bank that I might be able to do something with it. And that's it. That's my friends. It's my worst nightmare. There you go. Muito obrigado, meu brother. Here's what happened. I was coming out of Oma Fairs because I had to make a quick stop to go to Oma Fairs again to try to sort my visa in South Africa for the millionth time. And of course, they couldn't sort me out. While I was coming out, there was this guy who started asking me about skates because I have my skates attached to my bag. See it? Then, he told me, you sort me out with skates, I'll sort you out with a visa. Then he took me to this office and made me an offer of getting a South African visa for a pair of skates. He gave me all the documentation that I need and I'm not in the right floor. No. And I think I'm gonna accept this because I'm just <laughs> it's been in and out, in and out, in and out. I've been kind of going crazy to get this visa. So with this being said, it's now time to Put my skates back on. I ended up taking a little bit more than half an hour, but it is what it is. Back up skating. accomplished part two <laughs> I took a little longer at home affairs and it was like kind of like unexpected so I really need to get back to my shop and I really need to get back to work this just happened I ran out of head in the scooter I'm with my skates on and I need to put the shoes on and walk to the gas station. And now, yes, that's the end of another day.
day in the Lino life. I hope you enjoyed this one and I hope I don't run out of gas on the next one. Cheers! Vou viver até quando...